Hello once again YouTube and welcome back to The Domain. Now, I love a good old fashioned collab. It's a way to share your content, ideas and subscribers with other members of the community. And I've been in contact recently with a very special YouTuber and he sent me this cool looking parcel. Now this is from That 70s Dude and His Hobbies. He's a really cool YouTuber that I myself and a lot of other people recently have discovered. He started making Halo Megablocks customs and some Star Wars ones as well and his custom diorama work is just insane. He sent me a parcel today. This is something that I requested him to build specifically and I just can't wait to show you all. Let's see what he has in store for us today. Can you see what it is yet? Any fan of Halo Megablocks might have already seen this because it's actually a really successful video of his. Let's slide this off. This custom diorama was made just for me and it's the first of many collaborations that's going to be happening across this month. Oh my goodness. Look at this. For anybody who is a big Halo fan, you already know where this is from. This is Kat from Noble Team, Halo Reach, and she is taking part in the Deliver Hope trailer. It's one of the most iconic moments in Halo, just brought to life in exquisite detail, goodness me. First of all, we have the custom figure. This is Kat B320. And my goodness, that is such a wonderful level of detail. So this is actually painted from the Halo Mega Construct Series 10 Anniversary blind bags. So this is a full AC figure painted from the ground up. The dry brushing silver detailing, slight red mark on her chest. This has been brought to life. I am so impressed with this. And you'll notice she is also holding the bomb that is used to destroy the Covenant carrier in the Deliver Hope trailer. I'll be putting a link to the full video of how he made this in the description below. He did a full live stream where he built the whole thing from the ground up. It's a really cool watch and I really hope you can all check it out. But this isn't even the star of the show. This is the explosion the Banshee makes when it plasma bombs Cat. It will just gently lift off like that. You can see it just slides on really nicely and he's formed it to this mold here just so well. It's then got this little peg where you can insert Cat into it as she's being exploded, I guess. If we lift this off really gently, we can actually light the bomb up. You can have this flickering mid-explosion. Wow, I, I, feel, I feel emotional looking at this piece just because of how much nostalgia and, and weight this scene had in the trailer. I mean, it was the way that Noble Six sacrificed himself. So honestly, this was uh, a fantastic, I just noticed this is, this is just the lid of like a, a tub. <laughs> As usual, I always try and find some sort of base to put the uh, diorama on. In this case, this lid suited my needs. I only just noticed that, wow, that's so cool. I mean, the, the level of detail, the formation of this hard rock, dry brushed etching on Kat's body, the way everything fits and forms around this cotton, fantastic, I will treasure this for a long time. And this is the very first of many collaborations with that 70s dude and his hobbies, which I'm hoping will lead up to the biggest diorama I have ever made in my life. It's gonna be a very exciting month for the channel and for his, hopefully. I really do hope you go and check out his videos. He has so much to offer and I can just see his quality of content and his variety just exponentially increasing and his expertise on dioramas. These are getting better and better. Thank you very much for tuning in today. Please enjoy the montage that I'm going to follow at the end of this from the Deliver Hope campaign and yeah, there's nothing more to say other than well done that 70s dude and his hobbies, I cannot wait to see more. And Kat is signing off.